Welcome back. We have finished Jisha's journey. We are still in a rainy cleft here. One thing you can see here is uh, these flowers beginning to cover the uh, desert floor, which is also something that's described in the Book of Atreus. Which are very precious to him and to Tiana. Yes. The little blue flowers. And the steam rising up from the volcano when it rains is also described in the uh, in the novel. One thing that's not in the novel, though, is the windmill. So I guess that's a more recent addition. In Yisha's speech at the end, she also describes the cleft as being in Tamana. Another hint that it is actually close by. To uh, the Tumana we know from Mist 3 and 4. Although I'm not exactly sure where that is exactly in relation to uh, this place. Well, in this, in this sort of area of the United States, there's lots of those rock formations. Uh, the, the landscape around um, Tumana in Mist 4 is, is very reminiscent of this part of the world. Monuments. Um, stone monuments, the color of the stone and everything. Not so much here, because it's very flat. <clears throat> okay, we're back in uh, Relto now. Oh, and I'm in first-person view for reasons unknown. And it's raining in Relto, which also means that our fireflies have now uh, departed. Where they went, I don't know. But... Uh, they're not here anymore. I'm actually going to turn the rain off. I don't like rain. Well, I turned the rain off before I left the cleft, and I'm just going to go out and see if my fireflies are still here. Um, or maybe that they just go when you when you get the rain. No, they're still here. Mine are still here. Okay, well, I've turned it off now, and it should be... Uh, gone when I uh, come back here next time. Of course, the uh, fireflies won't return, so for one does back, I have to go back to... Uh, Itakimo. To Yeah, to Itakimo. And one of something these else trees is missing. here actually uh, is the tree we got from Kadish to Lisa, which has grown a little bit. It's now basically the same height as the other tree, so I can't tell which is the... Uh, which is the one... I think I think it's probably this one, though I'm not sure. It'll get bigger, then it'll be uh, it'll be obvious. It's right near the um, the stone rings because I have the trees from um, Eder Togal, so I have all maple trees except for this one um, fir tree, which is obviously the one that I got. On, yeah, um, but I don't have that, so. No, no. So it's right near the rings. Um. And we do actually also have all four rings from the ages, so even though we don't have the pillars anymore, you can still tell that we've finished all of these ages, even if I turn the rain off. Okay, well... And we don't have the cleft. The starfisher. The starfisher, no, the starfisher is gone, of course. Um, well... We were basically telling the story of Guildmaster Kadish via Kadish to Lisa. It's the last age we did before finishing this. And that's what we're going to continue now. Which means we're going into Erkana. And then Anone. We're actually going to do Erkana first. Which is the reverse order from what I did in my complete chronicles let's play the main are you in the library are you Sorry? in your library yes are you in you just noticed the cleft book there now yeah 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 yes indeed we also have the cleft book now which like Yisha said cannot be shared you can go to either the rainy or the sunny version
and you can tell it cannot be shared because there's only one hand on the tab symbol so you cannot raise this tab just like the Nexus book um, okay so we want to uh, continue with Kadish's story in uh, Arcana and Anone which means we have to go to the Watcher's Pub and unlike in Complete Chronicles you don't have a book to the Watcher's Pub you have to use the Nexus. Because the Watcher's Pub is also a public place. Which means that there might be other people there. Except there aren't. You can see there also should be one person. Well, not it yet. Be me. <laughs> not yet, apparently. You don't show up anyway. Uh, the Riders Pub is uh, so another place we haven't been uh, yet, which is the place I can access because I have the Riders T-shirt. It basically looks the same as the the Watchers Pub, except there's no tree and the color scheme is a little bit different. Uh, we'll just go to the Watchers Pub. Pop is also slightly different from what you may remember from Complete Chronicles, if you've played it or watched my Let's Play. There you are. Hey, nice new jacket. <laughs> I always wanted a red leather jacket. My, finally, my avatar has one. <laughs> One thing you can tell the difference is that uh, the viewer here, or the imager, is not on. And it's not showing uh, any clues. Because, sorry, because that particular puzzle does not exist in Uru Live. You know, that reminds me so much of the thing in the on the dock in um, Mist. In that little room under the dock, the imager and the... Um, the same round thing. Yeah, although that uh, this is actually an imager that shows vertically above the uh, the thing and not inside the the pool or whatever it was, the stone circle. But it is sort of similar, yeah, to the antechamber viewer in uh, in Mist. I guess that's the same technology. I mean, it just probably knew some dunny technology. And here's the great tree, which unfortunately we cannot get to. I know, that's so disappointing. And you you say you know what neighborhood is this supposed to be in the this, in the cavern? Uh, uh, this is supposed to be the Jateri district, if I'm not mistaken. Which is also mentioned in the books as a place that um, Atrus and Gen visit. I think uh, Gen and Atrus visited the common library in Jeteri when they were looking for blank books. One thing that's here in Complete Chronicles, uh, or two things actually, uh, is a shirt and a number on the wall, neither of which are here because the number puzzle, the number clue puzzle thingy is not a puzzle in uh, in our life. And well, I don't know why the shirt is, isn't here because they didn't turn it on, I guess. But but you do get the shirt. You get to be. No, that's a different shirt. Sh that's a different shirt. Oh, it's a different one. Yeah. They're both shirts with the with the gray tree symbol on them, I think. But ah. it's not the same shirt. Nora is talking about shirt you get at the end of Anone, which is also a shirt with the gray tree symbol on it. But that shirt is also in Complete Chronicles, and it's not the same shirt. Oh. Up here, uh, we also have a missing number clue. I'm not going to point out all of those <laughs> throughout all of the ages. And, of course, on the other side is the entrance to what we know is the path of the shell. Unfortunately, it is closed. We cannot get there. Um, I guess that makes Even sense. Even though they've got the button. Yeah, the button isn't powered, though. 
Yeah, such a pity. Uh, this puzzle, because because um, the Watcher's Pub is a public place, the puzzle would basically be impossible to do because you have to stand there for 15 minutes without somebody else opening the door. Um, you can still read the books, but you, can still you read don't really the, need uh, to. Yeah, you can still read words, the prophecy from uh, the Watcher. But they serve no purpose in the context of the game. And these were in your Relto library. Yeah, they in weren't here in, uh, in Complete Chronicles. They were in Relto. And... Well, I'm not going to show all of them. They are just as cryptic as ever. All right of time, so we'll continue in the next video.